My name is Ian Walsh. This is the moment money matters. Hard money bankers joined today with Lindsay Gordon, uh, specialist in second uh, second mortgages, non-performing notes. Lindsay, thank you so much for being on uh, on the show today. Thanks for having me. So uh, interesting. You're in Puerto Rico, and I just learned there's Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico time, as you said today, which is uh, never heard. I've heard of California time, never Puerto Rico time. So that's an interesting. Uh, I get it though. I know what you're saying. So. Um, so talk to me, Lindsay. What what do you guys do in the non-performing world? Like our, our whole note world, I do a lot with first positions, right? Our hard money lending, it's always first positions this, and, and that's all I deal with. Uh, really, I'm not a fan of the second positions in my world, but I know there's a whole world of second positions that people deal with. Can you explain like what you guys do from, with second positions and so forth on a property, or even what a second position is for somebody that might not know what this what that is? Yeah, so a uh, second mortgage could be a actual second mortgage, meaning it just comes behind the first mortgage. They um, That means that the first mortgage has to be paid off first, and then the second after that. Or a line of credit. Sometimes people go back to get a line of credit later on because they want to build a pool or they want to buy a boat or who, who knows what they're going to do with it, but they, they get a second um, mortgage that's a line of credit. And so back in like 2006 to 2008, they were creating a lot of these second mortgages and a lot of people were overextending themselves and couldn't afford to pay back the second mortgage. So a lot of them went into default and the banks had a lot of second, non-performing second mortgages where people were not paying and they didn't know what to do with them. So I created a company that was able to buy these from large banks, uh, medium-sized banks and, and large hedge funds to take a bunch of these second mortgages all at once and we can work with the borrowers and work on a more individual scale. Whereas a bank, they can't necessarily work um, at that level because they have much bigger things to be worrying about. Gotcha. So where do you step in? Like, what do you guys specifically do? Like, what, what would your company do? So we so we buy the, the mortgages from the bank okay. and then we turn around to the homeowner and we say, hey, do you want to pay us? And then sometimes they do <laughs> and sometimes they don't want to. And um, from there, we figure out a way to get the homeowner to be encouraged to pay us. And that could include uh, starting the foreclosure process or um, or even just um, having them speak with a realtor in their area or a lawyer. And, and we work out a, a deal with the homeowner to find out a plan that is going to work for them, whether that's a modification or a satisfaction or if they want to sell the house. Okay, that makes sense. So... For anybody that doesn't understand or didn't know what a uh, non-performing note was or a secondary mortgage, uh, I mean, ultimately the first position always has precedence over it. But you know, there's a world of reasons that when you when you buy those notes, typically at a very deep discount from what you guys do, especially when you're buying in bulk, um, because a lot of them unfortunately aren't going to perform. But there is a percentage that do. You guys weigh your numbers, you have your algorithms, you know what's going to pay, what's not, or 10 out of 20 pay, or 10 out of 100 pay, or whatever it is. Um, and then you guys go from there. So in the next video, we'll get into kind of strategies or ways that when you approach somebody that, you know, needs to get their, uh, you know, to, to do a workout or something. Um, so Lindsay, if I was trying to contact you or find out more about you, um, how would I do that? Do you have like an email or address or a phone number? Uh, yeah, my email, um, we're with silverbaycapital.com. Okay. Um, but I can also give you my like contact information maybe people could find me like on facebook or something first before Perfect. I. okay that's okay <laughs> sure and it's uh you want to spell your name uh so everybody understands knows exactly how to spell lindsay gordon it's um it's facebook.com slash lindsay l-i-n-d-s-a-y-e gordon g-o-r-d-o-n perfect Sounds good. And you guys know me, Ian at hardmoneybankers.com, and we'll join you for the next one.